not so easy. No. I was thinking, like, no, it's going to be. I just thought of a harder one. Here we go. Game over. Boom. I think this was on, this was on an old test. This, this exact one. It's ridiculous. So same thing. Removable and non-removable. And take your time. So you show all the work. I'll give you a couple minutes to try it. I'm going to, like, yeah. Um, so the bottom two factor, right? So solution. So we have g of x equals x. What can we pull out in the bottom? An x. An x, yeah. It makes it a little bit different. It makes it a little bit weird. This would have been a bad first example, at least in my opinion, because it's, not, it's a little bit trickier to find the hole. This cancels. So where is the hole in this case? x, x equals 0, right? Because the question is, I, I probably should have said this and I didn't say it. The hole happens at whatever makes this 0. So here, here, Negative 1 makes this 0, right? So if it was like x minus 7, then it would be 7. If it's x plus 4, it's negative 4. If it's x minus 1999, then it's 1999. So here the hole is at 0. Is this removable or is it non-removable? Removable, yeah. So you, just, you can just put 0 here. You don't have to put x. The homework is really picky. Uh, in 1.5, you'll be finding vertical asymptotes. In that case, you do have to put x. In this case, it doesn't matter. I'm going to put it because it looks weird without it. So, And then this is a VA, right? x equals 1. Would this be removable or non-removable? Non-removable. Good, good. Easy, easy, solid test question, right?